Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. University of Kansas defaces American flag on campus, flies it with foul message. The University of Kansas is being frowned upon as they have raised a disgraced, defaced, and destroyed American flag on their campus. The flag is being touted as art, but many people aren't buying it. If anything, this is horrible art and it's being done at a time where liberals are taking their toxic attitudes and ruining things on a crazy basis we haven't seen since the 60s. The defaced flag is reportedly part of an artsy installation called Pledges of Allegiance and it represents the polarized country under President Donald Trump's leadership. Most people would look at the flag and say something like why would someone ruin a perfectly good flag and if that's art, then it's horrible and both of those would be reasonable thoughts slash sayings. Anytime someone defaces the American flag, even for art purposes, then their motive should be questioned and they shouldn't feel so good about themselves for taking something that's very sacred and symbolic to Americans. Regardless, this is America, and if someone wants to deface the flag and then deal with the backlash, then more power to them. If they're willing to be looked at as a horrible artist and bad American, then they must be a liberal. Only a liberal would do such a thing. This isn't art, this is trash. How dare they ruin our patriotic symbol of the greatest country ever. If black paint spattered all over old glory weren't enough, on the bottom right-hand corner of the flag is the bizarre image of a black and white striped sock, which artist Josephine Mexper said represents migrant children crossing the southwest U.S. border. Don't ask my why it's a sock. No one knows. MRC, the flag is a collage of an American flag and one of my dripped paintings which resembles the contours of the United States, Mexper said in a post on Creative Times website. I divided the shape of the country in two for the flag designed to reflect a deeply polarized country in which a president has openly bragged about harassing women and is withdrawing from the Kyoto Protocol and UN Human Rights Council. But the sight of a defaced stars and stripes didn't sit too well with most people on social media, who immediately condemned the University of Kansas for allowing the flag to fly on their campus. As a U.S. Navy veteran and student at the University of Kansas currently seeking my master's degree, I find the artwork that currently flies at Spooner Hall heinous and abhorrent," one student said. To those who would trample, burn, or deface the flag, thank a soldier. It hurts me to see a defaced flag fly at the University of Kansas. My thoughts turn to my friends whose coffins were draped in our flag," another commented. The University of Kansas College Republicans denounced the school's decision to fly the flag, stating in a tweet, words cannot even begin to describe how big of an embarrassment this is. Republican Kansas Rep. Robert Marshall chimed in, tweeting, No, this isn't art, this is an embarrassment. Shame on KU, a public university, for flying this desecrated American flag over their campus. The University of Kansas should remove the defaced flag immediately. This is an embarrassment and colleges across the country should know better by now than to let some trashy defaced flag ever fly over their college. Anyone know what happened to our once great college system in America? We went from producing hard-working students who seek careers into people who take gender studies and deface flags. Is college becoming a bad idea? Why would someone think spending time in college to deface a flag was ever a good idea? It's a terrible idea. Instead of getting five minutes of shame, the faux artist should have made something that was actually worth looking at. Let's be honest. If you have to go to college for art, then you weren't that good at it anyway. Hopefully. They take that flag down so Kansas University can stop being embarrassed. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click like and subscribe. Thank you.